A data analyst and former United States Air Force major played a survey to embalmers across the country. Just look at this graph, graph number four. He found that 72% of embalmers observed white fibrous blood clots in 2023 um, corpses. 72% observed these blood clots. What's going on here? And there's a lot more to go through. Well, joining us now is the data analyst and former United States Air Force major who conducted this study. Tom Haviland is with us. Tom, welcome to the program. Grant, thanks for having me on the show to talk about this very important topic. And I'll just show the audience right here. Here's a some of the clots that we're talking about. There are nasty, nasty looking clots, right? So they do exist. Um, this all came to, to my attention um, the week of Thanksgiving of last year when that movie Died Suddenly came out. And about six or seven embalmers in that movie said they were seeing those white fibrous clots. I wanted to see whether that was a real phenomenon or not. So I conducted a, a survey last year to see what, uh, what embalmers were seeing through the year 2022. Uh, I sent out a, a, a link to a survey in SurveyMonkey to um, over three dozen national, regional, and state funeral director associations with hundreds of members underneath them. I also sent the email to over 1,700 funeral homes directly around the world trying to get responses from embalmers around the world to see what they were seeing. All right. And the survey, the survey we did last year, Grant, had three main conclusions to it. The, uh, about seven out of 10 embalmers were seeing the white fibers clots. Uh, the majority of them started seeing the clots in 2021 after the vaccines rolled out. And then some of these embalmers are seeing these clots in up to 50% or more of their corpses. So right. then I've done a, 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 uh, another survey this year then that's in progress right now that's, that, you, that you see to see what the embalmers are seeing this year at the end of 2023. 